Well, hello strangers. <laughs> this is Tuesday and I have been quite busy. Um, that's why you haven't seen me lately. I appreciate those of you that are asking where I'm at. But I just had a grand baby and um, I'm just working a lot and it's just been busy, busy, busy. <laughs> so uh, I did want to share a layout with you as soon as I could find the time and I actually have a few moments so fortunately I was able to do this in bits and pieces and get a video to you this is product that I'm using from the empty box 2 series and that is a summer series using a great big box of leftover kits and bits and bobs from my stash that I put together for summer layouts so I just took some of this white background paper and went into Adobe Illustrator and used a cut file by Allie Edwards from a long time ago and I changed the size and the color and created my title that says Bye Bye Summer. And then I took this Snowway Man by Shimmers and basically just got a little bit messy on the background to create some color and I think that's the only color that I use from the shimmers products but I think it worked lovely with that bye bye summer that I had done in a gradient color in Adobe and then this little background paper was also from the empty box so I'm taking some of the scraps and some of that paper from the box and layering up the back of my photos. And this is a photo of Alan and I. We were going out on the lake in Michigan. So Lake St. Clair with his uh, parents boat. And he was so super excited. So we um, had a good time. He was so happy. <laughs> He's such a cute man. So we had um, taken these pictures. I took a picture of him and he took a picture of me. And we just wanted to make sure that we had photos of this memory. So I grabbed from the Pebbles collection these stickers called At the Lake. They're pretty old. Probably somewhere in the neighborhood of eight years old. And I am just going to start figuring out placement. Now, I do move that one label tag that's at the bottom left. I'm going to end up moving that because I don't really like it. And I don't really like the bottom and how it's torn. I've been doing that lately. I'll tear something and then I won't like it. And then I'll cut the edge off and redo it. So towards the end, I'm not sure I recorded it because I think it was an afterthought, but Towards the end, stay tuned for the photos, the still pictures, because you will see that I changed out the bottom of the layout to a another piece of paper that kind of is like a red and white grid, and it kind of ties in with a chipboard element that I put on the page, and I, I like the way it balances it, so not quite so monochromatic it's got a little bit of that pop with the red once I add that so um, I think this is about where I decide to take that label off it's been so oh no I'm gluing it down I guess I'm gonna cover it up actually because if I glued it down I doubt it's coming up but yeah I had to have taken it I had to have taken it off because it's not sh uh, showing the way that I'm looking at it here in front of me. I did this layout May 5th. That's how backed up I am. <laughs> it's just, I haven't had a chance to edit and uh, make videos lately. So I've got this stockpile of layouts that need to be edited. So I apologize if my memory's not great. Uh, Maggie Home Labels. These are from, no, these aren't Maggie. No, these are crepe paper oasis labels. I don't know why I wrote down Maggie Holmes. I'm looking at the sticker set. And they say things like, hello, darling, cute, 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 and sunshine. Oh, now it makes sense why I took off that label. 
I don't like writing on my layouts. So that bothers me. That's probably why I end up taking it off. Typical Tuesday. She's always trying to write on her layout and then she gets frustrated and takes it off. <laughs> so I did use quite a bit of this Pebbles sticker sheets and I did I added that high and I think now I'm going for a couple of chipboard pieces from the Hip Kit Club Summer Bliss from 2014, 20, no, 2016, July 2016. And I'm also looking through this uh, Simple Stories Summer Days. And that's where I get that super cute little ice cream cone. Even though we don't eat ice cream. <laughs> I thought it would be cute. And then here is a blue ice cream cone. So I just thought that tied in really well with the summer theme. And then I love that little arrow that says ice cold drinks. And so, ah, there you can see at the bottom, I changed out that label and I changed out the bottom to that red trim. And I added just a little bit of thread behind some of my clusters. So that is the layout. I hope you enjoyed it. I appreciate you watching. Hopefully I can get another video to you very soon. I will talk to you later. Ta-ta for now. Bye.